Hey guys, Carly here. Today I will be cash stuffing our very first paycheck for the month of March. I know I'm a bit late than usual here because I was really contemplating if I wanted to do my March budget with you guys, but ultimately I couldn't because my work schedule had me working eight days straight because I requested my anniversary off with my husband, which lands on a weekend. So my, you know, it's just weird how the schedule rolled over to where 40 meets 40 equals eight days straight so that's just how it happened and i didn't have time to really film the budget with me with you guys but i do plan to and i will be honest like i've accumulated some debt through like our cars and like needs for me as daycare sometimes we couldn't really you know do all of that and also other things came up that we didn't really have the emergency fund for so we have accumulated quite a bit of debt again so I'm like really iffy about sharing that with you guys because it's just, it's not been all that great mentally for me when it comes to our financials and my husband and I were stressing about all of that but we're not really like arguing, we're more like trying to find ways to make more money. So we actually DoorDash, now we DoorDash every night if we can for like an hour or two and that's how we do our dates now we doordash and so far we've doordashed two weeks consistently to where we made money like last week we made 88 dollars this week we made a hundred so we do that and then i have my side hustle and then we both work it's just the economy right now is really bad like it's really hard to catch up and also the car failing was another thing that we really didn't take into account and it was just a whole ripple of effects that I could have probably maybe foreseen a little bit of it but I could also control my spending when I knew it was gonna happen because I was spending my patreon money on like things that I wanted but I should have saved some money for things that we needed so that's just a lesson for me to learn and keep learning so I'm like really iffy about sharing like our numbers with you guys but I know you guys are very accepting and are kind of on the same boat as me maybe not as bad but still in the same boat of trying to budget and survive in this economy so I hope we do and I hope we can all get through this but anyways I am gonna stuff our envelopes for right now and i'll share my numbers with you guys next month if i can do it i'm not gonna pressure myself into doing it i'll do it when i'm ready but i also have a sale this weekend because as i've told you guys we have our anniversary this weekend it's gonna be our eight years together but two years married or three years actually three years married and eight years of being together our anniversary and our marriage anniversary is the same which a lot of you guys have said is the same way for you guys which is amazing because that's great because i didn't know that it wasn't a thing that was told to me we just kind of wanted just one day to remember both of us so that's going to be march 18th and i think some of you guys are kind of close with our anniversary as well which is really cool so for that, I wanted to celebrate like 25% off my shop and also some freebies which I don't have ready yet. I will have like tiers to the freebies like usual. Like I think, I forgot the breakups but I'll have a button for I think a $20 order and like stickers, sticker sheets and I forgot what the other one is. I think a print or something like that but i have like exclusive freebies for the sale if you've reached a certain amount i just really wanted a gift for you guys for supporting my shop i've had so many customers that have kept us afloat for this past couple of weeks with helping me out with her daycare because i use my shop income for me as a daycare alone like whatever i make goes to daycare or supplies for my shop and a lot of you guys have been recurring customers and i really really appreciate it and i if i could make more freebies i would it's just supplies are also increasing so i wanted to share what i can and offer that 25 percent off coupon and hopefully i'll have my may budget kit by then so you guys can get it at a discount rate but anyways let's go ahead and start this cash stuffing i have my breakdowns right here which i think this one is rent all of my envelopes are empty right now because we just emptied it for paying the bills last month. And here we have our rent money. Um, we're putting 737 for this, which is a really huge chunk. And I cannot wait until we move in with our friend. We work with them 
um, right now, like the ones we're moving in, they also work at Target. One of them is actually a higher up, but you know, we were friends before he was higher up. So we're moving in with him and then another guy and then us. So I'm so excited for that. And we've been friends for a long time, so I don't have to worry about that. And that's gonna happen in September. I am vlogging on a different channel, guys. It's more or less studio vlogs, not really family or maybe house related, but maybe I'll post some personal related stuff on my older channel just to keep you guys updated. But I'll leave the link of my new channel down below if you guys are interested. And I try to vlog at least once a month there just to keep you guys in the loop because I always like sharing and documenting my life. But here we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700. And we need 20, 30, 5, 6, and 7. So let's double check this. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 20, 35, 6, and 7. And this is going to be like the last time I'll have nails. Um, just because I can't really afford nails right now. I thought about it like doing a filling for these even though I really love them. Um, this is going to be like 30 something dollars and then the tips. So it's going to be quite a bit but it was nice to have them and maybe one day I can do them again i just really like the french tips they're really cute and the one time i had like an ombre french tip that was really cute as well and hopefully i can get them done again in the future but for right now i'm focusing all of my extra funds from my shop patreon youtube all of that is gonna go back into my shop i'm trying to invest in my shop while still paying for me as daycare want to offer more stationary items like sticky notes notepads more planning stuff tote bags tumblers, mouse pads, all the different kinds that also will prepare me for these vendor places that I have coming up and hopefully we'll have more so I can have inventory for those. So that's where, like really why I'm, you know, saying goodbye to these nails even though I could probably afford having them especially with like them being included in my videos and whatnot. Um, I could live without them for right now to invest into my shop. So if you guys plan to shop during the sale, know that your money is going towards my baby's daycare and also going back to my business to hopefully grow it a little bit more. And, you know, just I'm so excited about everything. Like a little sneak peek of the new stuff coming out this weekend aside from the May budget kits. I've been like doing a lot of like pins right here like you can see all of the buttons here which I have my Studio Ghibli stuff or Ghibli I don't know how you pronounce it and then I've been doing buttons for for Sailor Moon which I have so much Sailor Moon right here and I just have those I've been doing those on the days that I have to work and you know just making art while i'm at work and then also some other stuff i haven't finished all of my releases i might make a release here but i have this girl right here this girl in the dark skin tone with her really cute cheeks i also have frankenstein here from monster high and claudine because you know we have claudine she's amazing and super fabulous so those are like some of the new things that are coming out with May budgeting kits that i've been really working on so i just really wanted to show you guys some glimpse so you can plan your you know spending and also i want to you know use more of my funds to hopefully get a sublimation machine and also some tumblers to offer to make those iced coffees I also wanted to offer you guys some more useful stuff that you can use, not just stickers and prints and buttons. So I wanted to incorporate that soon as well. So here we have our car, which is a new category. This one is a car payment that we have with our new car. Um, it's not really new. We bought it um, secondhand. Actually, it's been like the fifth. We're like the fifth owners of it. So we got it for fairly cheap. It was like $14,000 for a Dodge caravan like the small one a minivan so we have a minivan i'm so excited it'll work out with all of like the stuff that we have planned for these next few years like family trips conventions and all of that so it really does work out so we're paying 200 dollars every month and you're probably saying that's very cheap because we're paying my husband's dad so he opted to buy the car and like in full 
and then we're paying him the minimums until we've paid it off so it doesn't accumulate interest so that's his way of helping us and hopefully during tax seasons if we have any extra we can give it back to him so that also you know we'll, i'm still gonna count that as debt towards him because it's not just fourteen thousand. because after all of the closing costs and stuff like that extras here and there i'm not sure how much it was at the end which i'll need to get the numbers from him so i'll put that into the debt as well so we have jumped quite a few when it comes to debt so i'm really worried about sharing it with you guys um honestly i'm worried about getting judged but i try to keep an open mind that a lot of you guys followed me from when i was recovering from that and we were doing so good um i think people just really fall back to it and i just have to be okay with it and be okay with the negative comments because it does come with it but then again we've built an amazing community through me starting and sharing my numbers with you guys so i really just need to be open and We'll be okay okay just you know give me a second to be scared and then i'll share them with you guys i had to change my my memory card electric is getting 70 because we're doing bi-weekly paychecks now instead of every week so we have 50 and 70 for electric and that's been like the usual for us actually it's under but i just keep in there for extra wi-fi is going to be 35 I know I talk a lot when it comes to these cash stuffings. I'm, I'm sure I, you guys know that, but I just can't help it. But here we have 20, 30, and 5 for our Wi-Fi. And that's it for that. I might make a release video for my sale this weekend. And also show you guys the freebies. So there might be an extra video this week if I can do it insurance is getting 54 but i'll probably do it on instagram as well because i'm also trying to focus on reels because it has really good exposure for you know marketing and selling your business but here we have 50 1 2 3 and 4 for insurance and that should be it for this envelope i just transferred my my envelopes here and just you know have bills in here instead of sinking funds i haven't stuffed any of my sinking funds i don't know if we can honestly but here's the realistic view of our current situation oh my gosh we haven't paid my husband's phone for his parents this month okay i need to give that my phone is getting 54 as well it's probably the whole thing but I'm off today and I'm really like gonna hustle all day. I've been hustling all day, like preparing for my shop sale. And I wanted to be ready by the time I filmed this video, but I just couldn't. So I'll just film another video for that. But here we have 51, 2, 3, and 4 for my phone. My husband's phone is gonna get 40. But let me take this out, this $80 out, so he can pay his parents later. But we're going to put 40 in here. And again, because it's bi-weekly, I always have to remind my brain that it's bi-weekly now instead of weekly. Subscriptions is getting $12. That's it for that. I can get it to open. Okay subscriptions $12 gas is getting 60 and our gas is a little bit more because we've been door dashing but I think the payoff is pretty good since we've getting really good orders from DoorDash, which is really fun actually like it's a little fun activity that we have and I bring my iPad with me so I do some work while we door dash and he picks up the food and we spend time together so it's kind of like a fun way to have a date and still you know hustle a little bit diaper is getting 40 i mean 50 dollars i almost said 40 diaper is 50 which is the last 50 in there so that is it for this week's or this two weeks cash stuffing i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you on my next video which is likely going to be my new releases video for the may budgeting kit i hope i make it in time i'll extend the sale if i don't so just know that you guys will have ample enough of time to purchase i hope to see you guys on my next one bye